What's going on everybody? It's your boy Mayo back in the compound back with another video. Today I got a special video for you. Tuck's still working. I'm running solo today but hey let's get to the video. Today I got a top five video for you. Today is a top five favorite red sneaker in my collection. Go Patriots. But uh yeah this video was tough to to go from or tough to make really because one my favorite color is red so uh i know i could have chose like going with the uh i could have made this video with nothing but ones probably but i didn't i could have the homage the homes ain't in here the uh, that's the homage top right here the uh, the bread toes not in here just there's so many in here that i didn't choose i was trying to do a variety and all that type of stuff so it made it real tough i tried to do some some different ones but these are probably my top five favorite if you're not including the Amish, the Holmes, or the Bread Toes, or the Noels, the Track Red. Man, I could have made a whole video just on ones. But I didn't. I tried to choose separately and all that. But like I said, these are, so, these are some of my favorite of the Red Sneakers in my collection. Before we get to number five, uh, make sure you go check out the previous video of top five, it was top five favorite black shoes in my collection. It turned out, it ended up being the top six favorite because I didn't count very well when I was doing the video until I did the editing. So go make sure, it's the one when uh, my boy Trash Treasure called me out. Uh, the title is called, He Called Me Out. So go check out that video real quick. But, let's get to number five. Number five has already been on a video that we've done this year. Uh, it was a video. It was a shoe that I took on vacation with us a couple weeks ago, and it is the Cherry 13s. I love this shoe. Um, I love it more that now that I actually broke it out and wore it. Uh, it was really comfortable, actually. Uh, there's nothing much to say besides I love it. The Cherry 13s. Uh, finally took it off dead stock. No longer dead stock. I love it. But it's number five of my favorite red shoes in my collection. And now number four, it's tough choices, um, number four, and here we are, Jordan 11 Windlight 96. It's one of the first sneakers I got, uh, I ordered, I always loved sneakers, but when I really started collecting, it was one of the first ones I ordered, I do love 11s, but uh, Windlight 96, like I said, I love predominantly red shoes. But when you mix in the white midsole and the bottoms, oh, it's just it's just a good looking shoe. I love 11s. Uh, there was an 11 in my favorite black shoes. I'm sure there's gonna be 11 in a bunch of them. Like I said, Jordan 11, Windlight 96 is number four. Next up is number three. Number three on my. This one is. Uh, I think it came out. I think I got it in 2012, if I remember correctly. So. Well, I didn't get it in 2012, but it came out in 2012. And uh, the paint's coming off of it. It's it's seen better days. But uh, I know it's a, my buddy Joe. Shout out to my buddy Joe. It's one of his favorite in my collection. Man, I got to get some new pair of these. But uh, it's the Jordan 4 Fire Red. Fire Red 4s. Red, white, and black. I know they come out with a lot of Jordan 1s. But this is a 4. But I love this colorway. I love Jordan 4 is my uh, second favorite silhouette. And mix in with a red, white, and black. You can't beat it. It's probably one of my favorite. I mean, of course, besides Travis Scott's, but that's a little hype in me. But it's one of my favorite Jordan 4s in my collection. So, like I said, number three, the Jordan 4 Fire Red. And now, number two. Number two is kind of sentimental to me, but I do love this shoe. It's, it is the first Jordan. I don't want to say the first Jordan I bought. It might be the first real Jordan one I bought in my collection. I think it is. Uh, I've had to replace it because I wore that first pair so much. If you've been following us for a while, you should know what I'm talking about. But number two is the Jordan 1 Metallic Red. It came out in 2017. I know it's only 2019. Uh, so that doesn't make sense. That would be my first one. But I think it... To, to, for the whole collection, this is my number one, my uh, very first Jordan one to purchase. But uh, like I said, I had to, uh, I don't know if I have the very first pair anywhere. That might be in my actual closet. 
where my uh, other shoes are, other sneakers. But uh, I had to replace the shoe because I wore, when I went to Honduras, I, uh, I wore the Jordan 1 metallic red, my first pair. I got them dirtied up, got them cleaned, but just I had to get a new pair. And I love this shoe so much. Sentimental to me, of course. But like I said, number two is the Jordan 1 metallic red. Before we get to number one, first of all, I would like to thank my sponsor, Mayo. I'll throw Tuck in too because he's helped me a lot here lately. But shout out to our sponsors. Uh, hopefully we get real sponsors. But if we don't, we love doing this. We love filming. We love sneakers. So we do it for fun. Uh, honorable mentions, uh, once again, just like on the previous video, I didn't pull them, so, uh, uno momento. Uh, definitely one of the honorable mentions is the Jordan 10 Chicago's. The Jordan 10 Chicago's, I'll tell you what, it is a, it's a dope shoe. Uh, it came out in 2012, mine are still dead stock, but definitely, it definitely needs to be an honorable mention. There's a lot of red in this. I don't know if this should have been in the previous video, but I just remembered I have it. It is, uh, I'm not, I'm not going to get out the other one because it's about the same colorway. The Jordan 10 DBs, it is such a, I love this, this DB. And it's also the Jordan 7 DB down there that I, I can't get to right now. But, uh, these two colorways are dope. Got the same, uh, same red and black on it, but another awesome honorable mention. So, that's it for the honorable mentions. Now let's get to number one. Um, it's actually not going to be an OG, but uh, it's 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 probably one of it's my favorite Jordan one in my collection. And I'll now I know a lot of people are like, oh, an OG should be your favorite. Blah 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 blah. No, it's my choice. My collection, my choice. Just like we to say, even if other people don't like the sneaker, if you like it, rock it. So, but this is a pretty popular shoe. So that that saying has nothing to do with this. Number one, drum roll, please. I got to learn how to edit a drum roll. Number one, Jordan one into the Spider Verse. Man, mm, I love this. It's, of course, it's still dead stock. I took it to Chicago with me, but uh, I didn't rock them because it was raining some of the day I plan on wearing. So of course I'm not gonna wear it in the rain. But it is such a good looking shoe, man. Look at that. Of course, it looks like the Chicago, but got the Spider-Man print on it. I oh my goodness, it's so pretty. But yeah, this is definitely number one in the reds, in my reds in my collection. Uh, like I said, this was a tough decision of what I wanted to put in it in this top video because I love. I mean, got the fire red fives. I just got so many reds in my collection. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. We appreciate the love. Tuck will be in the next video for sure. Um, make sure you hit that bell in the corner. I'll put it right here over this. I know a lot of people aren't going to like the Patriots, so I'll put it right here. If the bell looks just like this, so it's going to be in that corner over there. Make sure you hit subscribe. Hit that bell so you know when we post. Uh, we, we're going to be trying to post more, more content, better content. Just keep believing in us. Keep sharing it with your friends. Follow us on Instagram at Mayo and Tuck. Look at that. Look at this. these features on Instagram. These pictures and these videos on Instagram. That was, that was a good day right there. Make sure you follow us on Instagram at Mayo and Tuck. Make sure you uh, follow us on Twitter at Mayo and Tuck. Like I said, subscribe. Please subscribe. Share it with your friends. Hey, until next time, you know what time it is. God bless and peace. Peace. <sighs>